All right, all right, all right, all right. What's up, everybody? I'm Big Mike. And I'm Brando. And I'm Clint. And this is Brewheads. You damn right. We are here still at Great Falls Brewing in Cannon. Mm -hmm. um, today we are going to try our second one, which is blueberry mango and black currant fruit snack. Yeah, that's a lot going on just oh, in the yeah. title. Imagine if, what it's uh, going to be like inside this glass. We've done a previous uh, fruit snack. It was the peach and was it white grape or peach and yeah peach and something. It was really good. Uh, you guys reviewed it. Yeah. Yep. You'll really put a good. link in the description below yeah. so you can see that see one too. It. This is a Berliner Wise. Uh, rings in at 4.5% horsepower. It's got a mild tartness rounded out with copious amounts of fruit. Oh, yeah. Love the copious. So we're going to hold it I up. I mean, the color alone. Color looks good. Sexy pink. Yeah. Where's your puck Red. factor fall into just the visual on this? It. I haven't started the saliva yet. Oh, I already did. It did you? looks, I, I, yeah. As soon as I saw it, I was like, When you like, see Ooh. this and the color and the texture. You know this and the hazy, flavor. It looks like it's it's a... It's a Berlin, a sour Berlin yeah, wise or sour. And, and that's just the visual. Yeah. Pa it looks packed full of goodness. Yeah. I gotta say. I can't Let's wait. Go to smell. Let's smell. See what happens. Does your puck change? Yeah. The puck is there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. But do you get that, that fruit snacky you get, you, fruit you, roll up? You know what? You can actually you can smell, smell the, the sweetness. You can smell the tartness. Yeah. Like tart, does tart does tartness. Tartness now. It's a smell. Now. I don't even know if it has a smell, but, but I smell tart. But you can smell also the sweet. All right. So, let's taste. Mm-hmm. Not, not really a puck. This is way less uh, this is a, sour. This is a mild tartness rounded yeah. out with copious amounts of fruit. The, the exactly peach, in that description. Ooh, that's the best. The one. peach one was way more sour than this one. I got it right here, but it's so fast. I'm right there in the jaw, but it's gone. Not on my tongue, nothing. It, where I get the tartness, like in the cheeks, but then it's almost like it Man. turns into like a wheat. Yeah. Overlay. Yeah. That's the, where it rounds out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's real legit. It has, copious amounts of fruit. It has a nice, like, uh, weedy finish. But the the oh. blueberry, it like, the blueberry comes in, yeah. and then the mango is, like, right after it, and it just, like, gives this weedy finish at the end. It actually... It's a mild It's weird, too. because you get the blueberry, and then it's mango, and then you're you're picking out that black currant at the end. You get three different flavor think, oh yeah i think the black currants that tartness that yeah. you get at the end of it yeah. or right before the wheat really good ooh, ooh. and it builds with every sip the puck oh that's good damn what are you guys thinking for personality of this thing <sighs> jesus like a like a disco dancer a go-go dancer you know what <laughs> yeah. yeah yeah i got that the bird from fruit loops the bird from fruit loops two can sam, two can yeah. sam. That kind of bubbly personality. A couple three crazy nephews running around losing his shit over. All right. All right. Um, Hufflepuff. Yeah, go that's, Yeah, that's pretty good. That's, yeah. So, let's ask the question. Put this beer in a Hogwarts house. Oh, Hufflepuff? <laughs> you just said Hufflepuff <laughs> for no question. It doesn't matter. Hufflepuff. Um, I, I think that's pretty accurate. I, I mean... <sighs> can't really see this in anything else. There's like a spice. Oh, no, the That's right good. There? That's good. That's a fruit snack. It is a fruit, fruit snack. Fruit snack. Yeah. Hell yeah. Ooh, damn. Question. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> damn, what candy does this remind you of? Ooh, there you go. Fruit snack. What once again, I don't know how they do it, but for me it tastes like the Welchers fruit snacks. Yeah. You ever had the Welchers? Fruit snacks. I've had Welch's. Whatever. If, if it had a, like a weedy finish, I would agree with you. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah, I, it's exactly that until the very end. Till the yeah, till that that well, weedy. Well, can't ending. be exact. That'll be copyright. I'm just, I'm just saying. That's yeah. That, it would be, I'm just giving if it was exact, it most likely get a copyright strike. I don't think so. Not if they create it on their own. You never know. Michael put a link to the laws of <laughs> copyright, copyright restriction. <laughs> oh, would you uh, you get out of work early? Would you swing by and get this if it was closer, in a package store, just because we're an hour and ten minutes away? I, I mean, Berliner Wises aren't aren't something I typically go out of my way for. 
uh, Berliner Weisses, Sours, you know, those, those, any kind of tartiness. <laughs> You're throwing a party with if I'm mixed If I'm looking to guests. impress some people, like, or yeah. not necessarily impress, but get something that other people might like, if I know Mike coming over, I'd pick this up. Okay. Yeah. I'd do that for you. I'd appreciate that. I really would. <laughs> Yeah. Like if I know someone's gonna be there that has a, a something sour, I would, sh- I would show off with this. Me okay. personally, would I go to the store to get it? No, it's just it, these style of beers are not. I'll enjoy them at a brewery. It's just not something I'm gonna purchase and enjoy at my house. Again, mostly because of the tart. It's a little harder harder for me to enjoy. Uh, yeah. Next exactly. Exactly. Uh. <laughs> I would drive the hour. Okay. I would drive you out. Yeah, yeah, these are your style. Yeah. If I heard that the package store near me had it, I would, I would get it for summertime. Is I would it, get it for summertime. I I find it refreshing up until the weedy finish at the end, where it kind of takes a little bit away of refreshingness for me. It gets a little dry yeah. at the end with the weed. Exactly. So I, that is why I partially don't find it that. I think, refreshing. but I think with a, a full glass, it wouldn't. True. Uh, it would it, it yeah. you would drink it faster, yeah. Because I mean, with the with the smaller glass, you've already finished, yeah, yeah, yeah. and you just got the wheat left. Yep. And I want, but it got me wanting more. I just want to. Yeah, I, mean, I would. I, I would I do a full glass. That. I could do a full glass of this, and we are both puck sensitive. So, do you guys feel this beer is dramatic? It's on the cusp, but it's not there for dramatic. It's not something that I'm gonna go. Wow, over or holy shit! Like it's something that I would again, I, you know, I would absolutely recommend this to anybody that does does mm-hmm. like those tartar beers or built Berlin, Berlin or wise, Berlin or wise, uh, or sours. I would absolutely suggest this to them, uh, but it's it's not something that's gonna. Yeah, you know, we've had sours and other Berlin or wises that you know there, there's like I can. Can't actually, to be honest with you, just because it's not my style, I can't yeah. really think of one off the top of my head. But just like every other beer, there's going to be that that one that you have that you're like, oh shit, you need to try this. Yeah. Like like the lemonade <clears throat> thing. We were we you don't even get me started with the lemonade. <laughs> don't even get me started when it when shit gets heated. <laughs> yeah. It's over. You need to try this. No, you need to try this. Like I, I wouldn't say this one's there, but it's like riding coattails. It's right. right there. I say this beer's dramatic, audience depending. Yeah. That's, that's what I mean. Like, yeah, it's like if you're into that kind of. Beer, I yeah. find it kind of dramatic, because of the puck factor, that little spicy kind of smell that I got, and the fruit that's in it. But I don't think you would. I think it's no, just for, a, a for, good beer. For me, There's it is tart. For, for me, yeah. it's a it's a very very good <laughs> Berliner Wise. The fruit um, pairing is very good, also. Oh, yeah. absolutely. So you can taste all the fruit that they put in it, but dramatic, no good absolutely yeah because I, I don't some of these pairings that I've seen in sour beers or smoothie beers or and I've looked at it like Ugh, like why would you put that whatever yeah and I've gone oh no no not oh, no I don't want those two fruits in my mouth together um pause but this I'll is <laughs> but this is a good pairing and I like that a lot yeah so uh, blueberry, mango, and black currant fruit snack. Like I'll be honest, blueberry and mango doesn't sound like it goes together to me. It, like, yeah. but it actually does. No, yeah. it, like when I first read it, I'm like, oh, I don't know how that would taste. Like, no, it does. I can see strawberry and mango, but I I, I, I don't think yep. I've ever had blueberry and mango before. We make smoothies at the house, and yeah, I've had. I've okay, had all right. I've had like blueberry pineapple mango. Cause you bougie, I forgot. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like <laughs> bougies out the house. I don't like anything with banana. And then I had the banana. Strawberry. Oh, strawberry banana, yes. Oh, damn. Yeah, that, was, that good. was good. Yeah. Uh, so I think you know, to each his own palates, but just a good pairing. <laughs> so let's uh, let's rate it. What we, what we got for ratings? I'm at like, I mean, it's, it, I like it. it's drinkable. Um, I'm gonna go three seven five. I mean, it, it's, that's where I'm I, at. I, I get minimal tartness. I yep. mean, like I said, I feel a little mm-hmm. bit in cheeks, but not. It's when my cheeks touch together. Right. That's I'm. I right. can't. I can't do that. <laughs> and like, your your face hurts from yeah. the, the the squishy of the cheeks. Yeah. And I'm I, producing more saliva than my mouse can. My, my mouse. No, my I, mouse can. Yeah. Handle. Yeah. My right mouth, in mouth can handle. 
Like, I don't get that with this beer. So this is actually something I can I can drink, I can enjoy. Um, three seven five, solid. I'm gonna mirror that right up. Everything you said, three seven five, um, minimal puck, but the the flavor is there. Um, you know, it's it for me in my sour range. It's this is on the high higher end of the sour range for me. All right, for likability. Yeah, you know, and I think absolutely. it's really good. Really good beer. Good job. Can't I want more fruit snacks? What do you got? I got a uh, four two five for this one. Really, really good. I love the fruit combinations that they're doing with the fruit snack series, and uh, really enjoyable, real refreshing, and uh, and this one actually, you know, isn't as you know sour as the previous one we had. The, yep. the other one we had we had a little bit more um, tartness to it, which uh, I enjoyed real well. Uh, Clinton, I mean, Brando didn't, but just yeah. for that tart, four two five. So that's our thoughts on this bad boy. Blueberry mango and black currant fruit snack. Berliner Wise brings in at 4.5% horsepower. So by the time this video comes out, if you've had it, let us know in the comments. And uh, Yeah, we just got the first draw off the keg. So. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> and um, if you've had any other fruit snacks or you had any other uh, uh, Great Falls beer, also let us know in the comments. Let us know what you think of the brewery, stuff like that. And make sure you check out all our social media, especially them grams, Why Clinton. Poppin'. We still be <coughs> popping. Crackle. I can't get that little. <laughs> you, for someone with a you, deep voice, you get that high pitch, like, naturally. Come on. Give it a shot. Poppin'. Give me, give me a. Give me an Instagram. I'll see if I can do it. Uh, make sure you check us out on the Instagram. Tell them why, Brando. We be popping. No, I just not. I actually kind of like that. I wasn't expecting that. That's yeah. why I liked it. In a world. <laughs> <laughs> We're building our wives and yeah. taking over. <laughs> one beer. One beer. One man. <laughs> one lip. One puck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, anyway. As uh, always. Drink responsibly, stay bougie. Catch you on the next one. Deuces.